the way you have to look at it is okay. Is that you know they're obviously it's a very important topic. That's not very difficult to, to guess. But um, I think the way we structure this meeting is unique to any other meeting in the sense that we, we look at it from a problem perspective, looking at all the people who are participating in the issues, and then look at it from a direction of solution. So, for example, the, the first thing we do is we talk about, you know, what is the issue with radiation? What are the real problems? Uh, from both, you know, from the scientific perspective, you know, what is the issue? What are we dealing with and what's the scope of the problem? And then we have two very well-known physicists speaking about that, but, but then we have the head of the FDA responsible for radiation dose talking about the FDA's, FDA's perspective. And as we all know that you know, the FDA has a tremendous role in this and, you know, how they think affects all of us in terms of radiology practice. So we have that. We then have Walter uh, Bogdanich, who I'm pronouncing his name very poorly, who's written a lot about the topic in the New York Times, which is really, uh, he's done a good job writing about it. It's a very difficult topic, as we all know, but it's a real highlight and it's a great honor to have him because he really represents what the public is thinking. You know, we're radiologists, we have certain ideas, but what does it really mean to the public and what's the challenge for us? And I think he gives uh, just a, a very unique perspective. He's a Pulitzer Prize author, so, you know, very important. And then we look at where, the solutions, some of the w directions. So, like, Image Wisely, Image Gently. Image Wisely was just announced as a campaign two days ago. Image Gently has been around for a, a little bit, but looking at, you know, what are we doing as organized radiology? How is how are we looking at the problem both in terms of the perception and the practice? How are we doing things differently? How are we making sure people you know, really do the low dose that they should do? We then have also another highlight, and I say everyone's a highlight, but we have Mike Pentecost, who's one of the, uh, he's a chief med medical officer of one of the uh, major health plans, Magellan Health, who looks at, you know, they're one of the companies that approve radiology examinations and how their perspective on the issue is. And since they're the ones approving exams, what are they doing within the context? Or are they doing anything specifically that affects how we indeed will practice? And then uh, we have a series of talks from, you know, four radiologists speaking about actual ways of doing things, not just theory, but how do you save dose in a very practical, hands-on manner, whether it's the new ideas about dose savings. Some of them were just announced at RSNA this week to dual energy and inner reconstruction, which are two of the hottest topics in CT. And then focusing on cardiac CT, how do you minimize dose in cardiac CT, which, as everyone remembers a couple of years ago, was the whole reason this whole dose thing became uh, front and center. What we also do is, what I did not want to do is just have lecture upon lecture upon lecture. But each of these lectures are sort of grouped in three, and then there's panel discussions. The afternoon one's grouped in four, but everybody else is grouped into three with panel discussions. So it's going to give everybody time to really address the issues, not just have the person's speech, but really be able to ask them directly questions and to have a really good discussion and really see where we are and where things are going. So I think, you know, what I want to do is I want to have a meeting that I would really want to attend myself. And so I think that's what makes it very exciting.